Hello YouTube and welcome to another video of mine. My name is Pony Xelna, aka Pony Bus. Today I got something in the mail, uh, my new graphics card for my computer. And uh, as you will see from the title, it's the XFX 6870 um, Black Edition graphics card, single fan by the way. So uh, I wanted to make a complete video of my complete uh, PC. So I waited till my graphics cards and I'll show you the rest of my PC in a bit. Um, also, I know it's not the most powerful graphics cards, but it's a good graphics card because I don't play at a at a like a high resolution. I play at 1680 by 1050, and my GTX 260 plays most games, but except for a couple of games, it has some troubles with. So uh, yeah, I got got this in the mail like 10 minutes ago, and I was like, well, I'll make a video of it immediately. Uh, there you go. Oh, yeah, that's put it up. <laughs> uh, it's the paper. Oh, they did a good, uh, they did a good job protecting it. Oh, it feels kind of heavy. Okay. Let me put this in the box with the box over here. Got some more light. Uh, there you go. So, yep. This is the box. It's a uh, XFX Radeon HD 6870 Black Edition graphics card, uh, manufactured by AMD. Um, before that, they were called ATI, but they got taken over by AMD. So, uh, which is cool because AMD is a good brand and they price stuff pretty well. So, so yeah, it's a very exciting product. Uh, I didn't pay that much at all for it, and I ordered it. So, you know, usually you go have to order shit to keep it cheap. So, let me cut it open here for a second for you guys. Oops. Oh man, this knife is terrible actually. Swiss Army knife. There you go. Put that back here. So, here we go. And the black edition is like a better clock than the regular edition. She's oh, actually pretty heavy. So, yeah, it gets awesome black looking box inside. <laughs> I've heard about this. You actually get a oh crap! You get a awesome uh, stickers you can put on your case or whatever you want. You know, XFX play hard and Black Edition and bigger and smaller stickers. Looks pretty cool actually. I'm probably gonna put this on my case. Looks pretty badass. By the way, now I know this graphics card isn't the best out there, but it's still a very good card. It plays basically all the games, especially at the resolution I play on. But I've bought this so, and I had in mind, uh, by the way, this is some commercial shit for their new stuff. They make power supplies as well, no XFX. Um, anyways, I know there's better cards out there, but I'm buying this and I'm gonna run it. And if I'm happy with it, I'm gonna keep it. If not, I'm gonna put this in my AMD computer and buy a new NVIDIA graphics card for this computer. So yeah, I don't really need a ridiculous card. Most, most games run fine with the 6800 series or the, um, the, the the older cards, especially my resolution. So, so yeah, open this up. Let's see, got some more stuff here. Driver, CD, install guide. We don't won't use that because you have to download everything from the internet, the newest versions. Quick install guide. Uh, this is the, the disc with I'm guessing the driver and perhaps some tools. Let me check. Yeah, drive installation. Uh, come on, get back here. So that's a little disc. And this is also pretty awesome. Do not disturb XFX Gaming Guard. <laughs> Do not disturb, I'm kidding. It looks pretty sweet actually. I already have one of these from, uh, from the 4870. It looks a little bit sweeter in my opinion. That the other one is uh, the older XFX logo, logo, which looks a little bit better in my opinion. So yeah, that was, oh, there we go, wait. I got some over here, I got no clue what, yeah. I don't know what this is. Feels heavy, black edition. I'm sure it is, I'll open it in a second. And also got a crossfire bridge. I've never had one of these with any cards, uh, NVIDIA or, or ATI or AMD, whatever. Um, this, these come with all the black edition cards. Now I know they didn't put any Molex to 6-pin connectors, that's because 
people who buy the black editions cards, so basically the hardcore gamer cards, um, usually have a good enough power supply to run this, you know, so that's understandable. So, before we'll do that, I'm gonna open this up here for a second. I've no got no clue what this is, but I wanna know now. I wanna know. <clears throat> Let's see, some plastic. Oh, this! Oh, gosh, this is awesome. It's like this cage badge with aluminum. It says XFX Black Edition. Sorry, the camera focus is not that good. And you can stick that through your computer case. I didn't know that. That's awesome because I love cage uh, cage badge but, uh, badges, but apparently they don't. Yeah, they didn't. You uh, you didn't uh, used to get one with XFX, but uh, that's that's pretty cool. So, yep. This, by the way, is almost as, uh, the, the clocks on the card are almost as good as. Um, oh shit! This card is heavy. Anyway, the card uh, clocks are almost as good as the clocks on the. Um, 5870, which is better because they, since any day took it over, they got new branding or whatever. I'm just gonna check if there's something else in here, and there isn't anything in here. So, yeah, let me show you guys. It's actually quite a heavy card. Oh gosh, look at that. That's a pretty graphics card. Uses two six pin power connectors. I have a Good power supply, you'll see in a bit. Um, you have a crossfire bridge. Wait, let me zoom out again. Oh, it's already zoomed out. Phil, oops, sorry. Let me show you this way. It's a nice shine on it, and when you put it in the case, it looks like this. So you got these awesome looking red stripes and well uh, thought out power connectors. So you got the crossfire bridge over here, and to the PCB and stuff and it's awesome because you know I like the single fan configuration oh let me show you before I forget the back you got two DVI you got an HDMI and two mini display ports so you can hook up a lot of monitors on this baby so that's gonna be awesome I'll be testing this like crazy so you got the card here it's very nice very sleek uh, I'm loving it and it's a single fan edition now the reason I went for this instead of the dual fan is because it was cheaper and my computer is already very very noisy so I don't really care so if I have to put up the fan speed I don't care but yeah this is the graphics cards guys this uh, will be coming in my Intel computer right now actually I'm gonna put it in right now without pausing the video hopefully uh, there we go this by the way is my computer I finally wanted to show you guys. I know the cable management is terrible. It is terrible. It really is. Uh, but I couldn't find a window, so it doesn't, I don't really care. And I have enough fans and pretty good airflow. It stays pretty cool all, all around. See that big block over there? It's my CPU cooler. I have two fans on there. Oops. And uh, you can there's right red stripes out there. My memory modules, the Corsair dominated GTs, four gigs total. I'm probably gonna put eight gigs in there one day. I'm not sure. So I got the theme of this case is black LEDs, by the way. And also wanted to show you guys this. This is my graphics cards I used in this computer, the GTX 260 from Nvidia, which will be going back into my AMD computer. It uses the same power connections. Looks also pretty sweet. So yeah, I'll be putting that back. It's kind of dusty. I have to clean it up first. Ah, there you go. Jeez, my back hurts for some reason. Probably because I'm a fat <laughs> Okay, so uh, let me put all that sexy stuff over there and put my stand over here. I'll be installing the card right now since uh, I have the power connectors over here already, so it's gonna look pretty sick actually. Okay, you'll see my face by the way for the first time. I don't really care. I need a new haircut, I know. <laughs> It's actually about the same size, but it feels a little bit heavier at first, you know. Um, yes. Line it up, come on. Yeah, there you go. And it's in. I know my cable management is quite terrible, but there you go. It looks really cool. I like the PCB is black, so fits really well in this case and it looks really nice so 
I'm probably gonna showcase this in my AMD computer as well because I love to show you guys how it looks in a PC with a window. Uh, because this is an older case, I can't order a, a side window or, or uh, side panel window anymore, sadly. But uh, yeah, that's it. Hooked it up to the power. Oh, it's kind of yeah. My camera stand is terrible. It's not complete level, but there you go. That's how it looks in my PC. But I, uh, I got the Corsair AX 750 watt power supply. It's a really good power supply, and you can hook up a lot of cards. I also, what I didn't mention to you guys, I got a new fan. Uh, bought a couple of new fans, and I have a new one terabyte hard drive in my computer over here. So yeah, that's basically it. I uh, hope you guys enjoyed watching this. Uh, I enjoyed unboxing for you guys and showing you my computer. By the way, for the specs, I'll leave the specs in the comment. And my processor is the uh, Intel Core i7-2600K. So uh, yeah, that was about it. Thanks for watching. Hope you guys enjoyed this. Bye-bye. Bye-bye.